Democrat Connor Lamb has outraised Saccone by a factor of three to one. Democrats hope it's a sign of things to come in November's midterm elections. In a district that, quite frankly, there never should have been a question that the Republican should have won. But instead, they're sending a Democrat from the heart of Trump country. I hate to put this pressure on you, Rick. They're all watching. Because I won this district like by 22 points. You know, George, it is a blow. You, you shouldn't lose a district like this. Well, here's the problem for Republicans. There are many Connor Lambs out there. These are people who have very deep civic ties in their communities. So message here is Connor Lamb is not a one-off. We went everywhere. We talked to everyone. We invited everyone in. When you feel good candidates, when you organize everywhere, and when you speak to the issues that keep people up at night, that's how you win. Double-digit swings now in five of these uh, congressional senatorial special elections. That really looks like a trend. It's a confirmation that this blue wave is real. That means Democrats are motivated and Republicans are depressed and swing voters are swinging against Trump towards the D's. The overall level of Democratic energy, though, right? I mean, that is that is just important here. I mean, you're seeing consistently in race after race, Democrats are significantly overperforming. We can win everywhere. We are winning everywhere. We're organizing everywhere. And that's why Democrats are back.